It's different. If you like different, that's different. something strange, different, and cool. This is a 2008 Thoroughbred Stallion. How many of these you've seen running down the street? Not many. We got it. So this is the Bayou Garage where we just love everything with motors and the community that surrounds it. If you want to take part, subscribe, stick with us. Send us a message. Let's talk about what you love. So this is a 2008 Thoroughbred Stallion. It's a two-seater. It's kind of a motorcycle. It's kind of a three-wheeler. It's kind of cool. So what do I know about this Stallion? Well, it's probably more of a Stallion than I am, but it's got a four-cylinder engine in it made by Ford. The equivalent of 2,300 cc's. About 180 horsepower. Really fat, big back tires. Air conditioning, radio, the whole nine yards. Even heat. So we were doing some research on this stallion and we found out that in 2006, 2008, and 2013 were the only three years they produced it. They made it in very limited amounts. It's made by a company that puts together three-wheel trike motorcycles and creates trikes out of them. And that company makes trikes for Harley Davidson and Suzuki, Honda, every kind of bike out there. If you want a trike made out of your bike, they will do it. That's kind of what their specialty is. But it looks like they came out with something all on their own. It's got the gas pedal on one side and it's got the brake pedal on the other. So you're gonna have to learn to drive with two feet, unlike a clutch where you actually shift over here. This one's fully automatic and you actually use your left foot for the brake. It takes a couple seconds to get used to, I'm not gonna lie, but everything else is like a car. It has the shifter into a rear neutral drive for a second, just like any other car. And this thing was factory maintained by Ford. Ford dealership. So I guess since it's a Ford vehicle and all the maintenance was taken care of at Ford, it's got a Ford engine in it, a little four cylinder. Not sure what that was coming out of in 2006, 2008, but this is the creation that they created. And that might just be the biggest set of front pillars I've ever seen. What do I know? So I can say that like most people in Louisiana, I'm gonna take it they were a Saints fan and they had the little hood. I don't know if this is custom made or not because I don't know how many people would go out and make stock things for this kind of rarity vehicle. I'm just thinking there's not gonna be a whole lot of accessories you can buy for this unless it's from the company that actually built the product. But it is interesting. It does catch your eye and it's something different. And if you like different, the style might be for you. So it does have a full trunk and inside the trunk is the actual side panels to put on the, by the doors. I'm taking it, it's for inclement weather, kind of try to keep some of the moisture off of you, water off of you. I don't know what other accessories this thing may have, but if you check out their website, which we'll link in the description below, you can find out for yourself. I'm gonna do the same thing. But yeah, it's got a trunk. Now take a second and tell me in the comment section below if you happen to know where these taillights are from. I feel like I've seen them somewhere before on some other vehicle. I'm thinking kind of maybe an Acura or something possibly like that. I'm not sure where these taillights came from, but I'm pretty sure if you know, throw it in the comment section below where this little rear end came from. It looks familiar. Now, if you're anything like me, you kind of love something that has a little bit of a sound to it, and this one does have its own unique little four-cylinder sound. It kind of sounds fun, groovy when you're driving it. Spin the tires a little bit. You can get the tires to spin, and especially if you're turning a corner, it will slip and slide a little bit. And I think the more you play with it, the more you can push it and see what would happen next. So nevertheless, this 2008 Stallion is probably the most interesting vehicle we've had on the Bayou Garage yet. And we have a huge goal in the future to go ahead and drive every single make there is. 
that's the first list and there's a lot of makes out there and at the end of every video we're going to be adding new makes to the list and do some Star Wars effect or have some fun with it to make you laugh to show you what we've driven and what you'll find on the channel I hope you stick with us I hope you enjoying these videos because we're just a bunch of Cajuns average guys that love everything with a motor we want to drive them all and we want to meet all of you guys that own them drive them love them too because it's all about community we are driven by community so this is the Bayou Garage stick with us and let's go see what we can find next let us know. Do you want to know in the comment section what you think of it?